Hey guys, I know we don't usually uh, film much in the big shop, but I thought today that I would give you guys a little sneak peek of something that we're working on uh, and that we're going to be releasing here soon. We're going to be cutting it out with our uh, Bailey plasma can. Uh, and it's going to be uh, some cool stuff coming up, but this one uh, in particular is something that I wanted to like give you guys uh, a quick peek uh, at. Uh, it's going to be one of our production Bigfoot signs. Uh, I think it'll be really neat, really fun, and we're just going to show you guys how we go through the actual cutting process and preparing the steel and everything. And just to let you guys know, we do design all of our metal art in-house and we also do custom designs and if you guys are ever interested in that if you guys can get in touch with us here on uh, YouTube or you can hit us up on our uh, social media like Instagram at McKenzie Brothers Design we do everything from production pieces to custom one-offs And here you can see I'm just tidying up the piece, removing some of the dross that occurs from the cutting. The more you fine tune the cut speed and the voltage and amperage, the less dross you actually get. Uh, this piece has very little dross, if any, and it's barely hanging on. It's very easy just to tap off. And here you can see just how little effort it takes to remove it. And what I'm going to be doing next is just removing the light surface rust this piece has. Uh, normally we don't have any surface rust on the steel, but because I was using a piece of scrap just to test the dimensions, the cut speed and everything to dial in the piece of art, and I don't really want to waste it, I'm going to go ahead and clean it up for myself and here you can see that I've removed most of the rust from the front and the back next I'll be putting it in a rust preventative black primer and paint and here you can see how the production pieces will look all ready to roll out for the customer but since this is my personal one I'm gonna get a little crafty with it and have some fun just to show you what you can do once you order one of these pieces if you want to customize it or have us customize it for you. And here I'm just applying a little bit of Rust-Oleum's direct to metal paint in brown for the base of the trees. You'll see I'm going to start doing a lot of different layers in these next videos. I went ahead and hit the Sasquatch as well. And here I'm just going to be having a little fun with Modern Masters Oxidizing Iron Paint and their Rust Activator. This is just going to give uh, the Sasquatch a little bit of depth, kind of make him look uh, fuzzy, hairy, and kind of matted up.
And there you go, guys. Feel free to share the video. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, don't forget to like, subscribe, and check out some of our other videos. Thanks again.